Dr. Nandin Daito also commended the campus for its strong focus on research, saying it will enable the institution to make well-informed decisions based on research. That if we in Africa, we cannot invest in research, we must forget to address poverty in our countries. And uh, that's why I'm really happy to see uh, the research that is going on at the Ogongo campus, uh, which uh, at some level accompanied by the production. The Ogongo campus serves as a training and research institution specializing in crop production, forestry and livestock production. During her on-site visit, the president taught several projects, such as that of poultry, where she observed a hatchery, table egg production, and chicks production that are supplied to local markets. The delegation was then taken to the AgriPV initiative, which integrates agricultural production with electricity generation on the same land and control water usage. But here what we have now, we have got moisture meters. I think water is a very important resource in Namibia. So what we are trying to do is to make sure that we optimize the use of that water and we have a census. A brief on rice production was shared with the head of state and her delegation. They were informed that 21 tons of rice from seven hectares was already harvested in June this year and sold locally. The campus provides training to small-scale farmers on rice production and thus far 4,000 farmers have been trained on rain-fed rice production. They were then taken to the rice milling station to be shown how rice is processed into different varieties. Your Excellency, what, what you see here is the, is the result of uh, this ongoing research, innovation, and our uh, contribution to food security as you know. So we continue doing so, and uh, together with the I said the Minister of Agriculture is here, they are all here. We are all in one line. We are going to, to do what we can do to serve the nation. We don't want to go hungry. 70% of Ogongo Yunam campus is focused on research, 20% on education, and 10% community programs. In terms of the investment, they are hard to see where to buy a team from an entry It is our mandate to make sure that Namibia has the competent human resources that it requires for its development. That our education must be, our education and research must be responsive and relevant to the needs of Namibia. Tanatania Embody, NBC News, Ogongo.